Hoplot. Hey. Well, what's up, blood? guys? What's up, everyone? You're one of my favorite people on the internet. Oh, you're one of my favorite people on the he internet. That all the time. Stop. You're one of my favorite people to throw money at on the internet. <laughs> I appreciate you throwing your money at me at the internet. All right, so Flux, would you consider yourself a conspiracy theorist expert? Uh, no, I would consider myself a conspiracy analyst Ooh, expert. Okay. Ooh, fun. So, yes. What do you mean we, by that? On, What's the difference? On my channel, we do not call ourselves conspiracy theorists because we're not theori theorizing anything. We're just taking conspiracies from the past that we know exist, and we're analyzing them to see how they compare with things that are happening now. The term conspiracy theory is a dirty term coined by the CIA after the JFK assassination for people that didn't like the Warren Commission. Mm-hmm. Uh, so, Stromberg really wants to that. know uh, who unalived JFK. <laughs> the CIA did. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> As it was, like, so there's there's this woman that I work with. I love her to death. She's like a mother to me. Um, and she was talking to me, like, before Christmas. And we were just talking about, you know, like, kind of crazy, weird facts and stuff. And she told me, she's like, oh, you know, there's this book I saw. I wanted to get it for you. Like, I want to get it for you for Christmas. And I was like, oh, it's the book called. And she's like, I, I can't quite remember. It's like... Uh, books of unusual facts and I literally I was like oh the book of unusual knowledge and she was like yeah and I was like the brown one she's like yeah I'm like oh yeah I already have that book oh, and shit. she just kind of laughed and like the fact that that's she saw that book and thought of me and like Aww. that's that's what she thought of I'm like just a person who would love random like crazy facts. I'm like, I love that so much. If that's what everybody thinks of me, that I'm just, you know, random crazy facts. Oh, hey, flux. Then that is the greatest compliment. I will, I will take that. So, what are your future plans for your channel, there, flux? To keep it going. <laughs> hopefully, uh, <laughs> to keep going strong. Eventually, I'd like to quit my day job and just, if I could, paint all the time, I would. Um, but when I do paint streams, it's difficult because, like, when I sit down and paint, it's going to be a minimum of four to six hours. Like, there's no, oh, let me just sit down and paint for a minute. Like, it's something that I do that I got to kind of clear time for if I want the painting to not be completely trash in my opinion oh look at that that's awesome that's, uh, that's one thing that i painted yeah i'll sit and um i talk less because i'm kind of concentrating more but uh flux talks less really when i do paint i talk a lot less he doesn't hardly talk yeah i i because i'll put on my music and then i just go and then what I do, like, it's hard to have painting streams and, like, guests because I just, I end up focusing so hard. I'm trying to, like, listen to, so it It didn't work out so great, uh, work out so well. But I think I'm going to attempt it again soon. Um, so, ultimately, I'd like to one day kind of just paint all the time. Um you know, and obviously still keep my mind Minecraft streams. But, um, you know, hopefully one day I can just kind of go to painting full time. Because if I could sit down for a full eight hours every day and just paint and, like, make a living off of that, that would be so awesome. Can we talk about how awesome that uh, Minecraft stream is on Saturday morning? 100%. <laughs> so what are we looking Ooh. at here? This... This is the Wendy H. Grand Library. This Look at this thing. About, I want this it, like, grand. Miss, Miss Fluck said it took, like, a week. And it just took two straight weeks. It took that, two like, weeks. Yeah. Laying that floor. That floor like, is gorgeous. It is absolutely beautiful, but laying it was a nightmare. We can't, like, this took us so, and she's like, no, the second floor is going to be, like, wooden. I'm like, okay. I want to like, live in that so bad. 
It's pretty I am awesome. so proud of that. It's and so, it's I'm like, y'all got me. Like, I'm like, that's me. Like, I'm a grand library kind of gal. And, and like if that. you, if you super chat, these are the monuments that she built. See mine, this is mine, the gold one, right? Yes, yes. But this is um, Legal Vice's ship that you're building or that yep. Mrs. Flux is building. Mrs. Flux is currently, yeah, we're, she's got a good portion, uh, good portion done, but because um, she kind of had to like eyeball this one. There it is. So, so the blue one is Brandon's, and that little one next to it is Valhalla. Right here, that tiny little the, the hay bales. <laughs> yeah, mine's made of hay. So I this is. You, I thought you'd like the hay. It's good. It's good. I, I thought you'd like the hay bales. <laughs> that was what is this Mine's that you're building for Brandon? Thank you, Chris. This is, this is Brandon's, uh, the outline of Brandon's pirate ship. So Mrs. Jeez. Flux. Is well, it big so, enough for him? Is he compensated enough for his well, lack so of it, other features? How it is is, you know, you have to think of it like, like <coughs> a piece of note paper. And I'm just putting, these are just the lines on the note, note paper. So when Mrs. Flux starts like outlining the boat and starts building the boat, she kind of has lines and and markers to kind of go by. I think it's a really cool concept where it's like, hey, you come, you build, and you talk. It's a really cool concept. Damn it. So I don't know if you knew this, Dave, but on <gasps> this, this TNT oh, launcher right TNT. here. Oh, wait, right here actually blows so up. it's got this thing so i can actually like launch it launch it nice. yeah so are you done by do the way now. hold on let me see yeah wait hang on are you done we got to do solo layout that's I really am. cute hold on let me put let me put the tnt back oh so, flux. On, let's get the light on it that's beautiful yeah. everything is awesome I don't know if it works how to get it to zoom in, but it's good. It looks good. I could see it. Th so yeah. this this is a little slime, which he's like he's so cute. I'm so I love happy him you so know much. the names. <laughs> yeah, well, it's just it's a little slime monster, and then this is a frog. We got a little frog down here. He's so cute, and this is Alex, and then we got we got a, a zombie mob right here. Very so. cute. Yeah, it's it's pretty awesome. I love it. it. Really is. I'm gonna I love keep it. it right are you gonna keep it? Yeah, are you gonna display it? Oh yeah, I'm gonna keep it right back there. I oh. think I'm gonna buy Legos again because like this was so fun. Next and time, I'm buy glad a you enjoyed it. It's, it's fun like having eight, like a nine. tangible <laughs> product. In fairness, I sent those to her, and she was so excited. She's like, "I'm gonna save these for when I'm on I, the Lego stream." And I said, "I know, I'm like, oh, I'm not doing this I guess she's anybody. coming on the Lego stream." <laughs> I would say it's a fair assumption that if Dave mails you Legos, you're probably yeah. supposed to be on the Lego stream. That's I love it so estimate. much. I get. That. I mean, that's that is honestly one. It's a really cool concept to like. It's almost like here's Lego. I don't know. I think it's a really cool concept where it's like, hey, you come, you 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 build and you talk. And I mean, if you get if you happen to get a Lego set also, that's just a bonus. Hey buddy, how you doing? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. You are really intently looking at something. Uh, well, I dropped the piece and I can't find it. Being interviewed and trying to do Lego at the same time, harder than it seems. Great uh, guest to have on too. In the beginning, he was kind of like, as we all were in the beginning, how should we act and stuff like that. Now he's uh, he's such a fun guy to be around. And then he said something about like a, a tramp stamp or something, and, and the girls were like, "Hey, where is that? What's this all about?" 
I'll show you mine if you show me yours. I'm like, whoa, this is not that type of stream.